Hello everyone, Zane here and welcome to my new player's beginner's guide to Final Fantasy XIV. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how to unlock the Aesthetician. Before we continue this video, if you're new to my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button for more Final Fantasy XIV content and join the first brood. Now back to the video. So the Aesthetician is basically the hairstylist of Final Fantasy XIV. In this game, you are given default hairstyles for your characters. There's plenty more hairstyles in the game that are not by default. So you're going to have to go find them or buy them off the market board. Some of them can be really expensive, but they're always adding new hairstyles to the game. Horathgar and Vieira cannot change the hairstyle outside of what we have default-wise. So they are excluded, unfortunately. Alright, in order to unlock the Aesthetician, you have to get through the Envoy main story quest first. And right before you do Sastasa Dungeon, these quests should pop up right here. This NPC here, whose name looks like somebody just rolled their face over their keyboard, unlocks it. Beauty is only scalp deep. And we get a token which makes your first haircut free. It costs 2,000 gil every subsequent time you want to change your hair. By the way, the coordinates are X 11.1, Y 11.0, by the way. So we need to go to the disgruntled madam, which she's right over here. So we're going to go north and wrap around. All right, you're going to need all three city-states unlocked in order to do this. So that's why it's unlocked after the Envoy quest is done. And now we need to cast Doubt on him. So go into your emote menu and cast Doubt on him. All right, so now we need to go talk to the blacksmith in Limps of the Mensa, the carpenter in Gridania, and the alchemist guild in Ulda. All right, so I will see you guys when we get to the blacksmith first. All right, guys, so here we are at the armorer plus blacksmith NPCs. This is basically south of where we were. So talk to the guild master. And now we need to zip over to Gridania and talk to the carpenter's guild in Gridania, all right? So when we get there, we will continue. All right, guys, so here we are in Gridania. So the Carpenter's Guild is going to be this way. So it's basically left of the main Aetherite. Talk to Guildmaster Beaton. Alright, after him, we now need to go to the Alchemist Guild in Ulda. Alright, so when we get to Ulda, we will continue. Alright guys, so here we are in Ulda, so take the Aether right up to the Alchemist Guild. And the guild is going to be X 9.2, Y 13.4. You can come right here at X 9.8, 11.8 to take the stairs right upstairs. All right, so now we need to go talk to Severin. All right, so now we need to go back to Ulda and give the three missives to our friend here. All right, so when we get back to Limps and Lamensa, we will continue. All right, guys, so we're back in Limps and Lamensa, so take the eighth right to the Ath Castle location. And then just go wrap around here. Through the doors and take a right. And back to the NPC. Get the packages over. Let's 
skip the cutscene. And that should be it. So we get our experience points and a token for a free haircut. So the aesthetician. You have befriended how you pronounce his name by using the crystal bell found in your in-room. You can call upon the services of the flamboyant aesthetician. From hairstyle and color to face paint, he can create a new look for merely 2,000 gil whenever you feel like a change. You also can craft the crystal bell and put it in your free company house, personal house, or apartment for easy access. All right, so that's pretty much going to be it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to leave a like if you found this useful. Any comments, questions, and or concerns, please put them in the comment section down below. I'd be more than happy to help you guys out with any questions you might have. And of course, don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're new for more Final Fantasy XIV content and join the first brood. As a reminder, make sure you hit that notification bell next to my subscribe button. This way you guys never miss an upload. And if you want to join my Discord, the links will be in my About section of my YouTube channel or the banner. So until next time, me forever walk in the glorious light of Lord Bahamut. Take care, guys.